Alright, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. Uh, today, we're probably just gonna do a greedier run. See how that is. Uh, last run, we kind of figured out how to use the D6 better. Not D6, that's what we have right now. Which we will probably reroll. That's fine, Charm Tears, whatever. Uh, check out these pills, see what we got. Probably re-roll those, I don't really care about them too much. We uh, lost our spirit heart for that, but I had to check. Now... Not really expecting this to be much different than regular greed mode, but we'll see. Because regular greed mode, usually pretty short, and last couple episodes have been like 45 minutes to an hour, so I, uh, I wanted to play, wanted to do a little shorter video. So, yeah, greedier mode. Haven't done this yet. Don't even know what's different, if anything. But it looks like it's the same thing so far. That was stupid. I just walked back into him. Uh, but yeah, usually greed mode, you get a couple items. You look for a specific set of items and then you just roll out of control. But eh, we'll, we'll see what happens on this run. Right now just trying to kite everything around. Just use a bomb for this. What am I thinking? There we go. That was a ton of them. No need to not use a bomb. Maybe on Greedier? I see it is at 11. Like 9 out of 11 right now. No, I didn't. <sighs> the bad joke that shouldn't happen that I didn't even intend to happen. Uh, hold on, let me try to fix this. Let me, let me try to set things right. Okay, we're about to be at 10 out of 11. That's what I meant. And, uh... I don't know. None of these. Chaos. Okay. You know what? I'll take chaos. Why not? Chaos seems fun here. Uh, who's the boss? Probably Pin? Yeah. Wait. I have 10 seconds? Oh, okay. That's where it starts to get a little harder. Pin and Ragman. Well, Pin should be dead any second now. Uh, I'm actually gonna go get the deal with the devil, or do do the extra boss to get the deal with the devil after, or not after, but before I get chaos, just so uh, we'll actually get a decent item out of there, when instead we could get like, pay one red heart for one red heart, or something stupid along those lines. Uh, dodge that. Alright. Fairly easy so far. Like, the only thing that I can really tell is different is the boss stuff. Which is fine. It got a little ridiculously easy once you got going. And I am imagine that it still will be. Okay, these guys shouldn't be bad. I just have to kite. Maybe, maybe they are going to be bad. I'm probably going to die if I don't kill Lust right away. I might die here. Okay, okay, we're good. We're good, maybe, maybe. There we go. Alright, so this is looking pretty good so far. Taking a little bit of dumb damage, but other than that, we're 
pretty fine. As long as we don't stupidly get hit by this little baby here. Because he's going to charge us just like Lust did. But yeah, we, we're, we're looking fine. Uh, then we just see what's in our deal with the devil. Hope it's not Krampus. Because if it is, we probably just lose then. And then I'd uh, take Chaos next. So, no Krampus? Runes? Okay. Yara Rune? Ooh. Go ahead, pop that. Uh... Yeah, okay. I'm going to take Yara, because that will get us snowballing really hard here. I can see forever. Power pill. Okay. Probably the most important one was the heart. Unless... Okay, that was pretty good. We do have a key for down on the next floor. And Yara will just double the amount of money we get from the next floor, so I'm good with that. That's pretty good. Oh. Let me check in here. Cuba meat is great. Reroll both of these. Guppy's paw, yes, please. Uh, I'll take just that for now. We can actually come back in here and reroll that later. Now, what else do we get? We got breakfast, which I don't really care too much about. But, if we do want it, that is just... What is it? Three spirit hearts? Because we have Guppy's Paw? I'm probably going to go with uh, toothpicks right there. But we don't have money right now. So, uh, let's go in here and check this out. And we can't get anything. Alright, well, it was worth a shot. Dang it, don't take that. Don't take the money. Don't take the money. Alright, I'm probably gonna take some damage trying to get aggressive and do damage with my uh, Cuba meat. Just because our damage is kind of bad right now, and we need to take out that monster spawner like immediately. There we go. Go take these guys out. Just oh, charm tears are actually really gonna help here. I always forget how useful charm tears are until you use them. <laughs> Having enemies attack each other, I love it. But hopefully, we don't take too much damage. I know we are going to take damage just from using the Cuba Meat. And it's it's worth it. I really want to get in there and use it on these guys, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what, what was that? Okay, I really don't know what that was. Like, my keyboard just messed up and... I hope my keyboard's not messing up again. Alright, well... These are the last set of enemies, so don't really need to worry about taking too much damage from them. I'm probably going to, uh... I need to kill the one spawning stuff. Probably gonna run in there, use Guppy's Paw again, before... I don't know if that one will explode or not. But I'm probably going to go in there and use Guppy's Paw again before we fight the bosses, just to be safe. Because that'll get us up to four hearts. Yeah, definitely now. That would make me a lot more confident about this, at least. Alright, I'm getting in there. There we go. Alright. Can't let those guys just do whatever they want. Guppy's paw. Use it. Reroll this. Anarchist cookbook. 
That might actually do well with the boss. So I'm going to take it just for the boss. Go ahead and see if I can get these guys out of the way real quick. And all it did was make us not have as much effect on our Yarrow rune. All right. Pin again? Yes, two pins. Okay. There we go. Oh, okay. There was one enemy spawned. I really just want to get in and do damage with this, but this guy really isn't letting me. There we go. And he should be dead fairly soon. Oh, they spawn more. Okay, cool. I don't think we get any money for uh, the deal with the devil one. So I'm going to run out, run back in. Let me let me go ahead and pick up my D6 because I'm not taking that Anarchist cookbook. Break the poops. Uh, just in case we get more money. And Yara this. Okay. So, we're at a good bit of money right now. Okay. Uh, take toothpicks. That'll help a lot. Book of Shadows, I don't really care too much about. And I can't... <sighs> okay. Uh, 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 this is rough. Because I need damage, but I really want the guppy transformation. <laughs> uh, so, guppy's tail doesn't do anything for us besides contribute to the guppy one, because we don't get chest from this. So I'm going to take Steven. So this should increase our damage by uh, a pretty good amount. Alright, just dodge the eyes and the the tears. There we go. The eyes actually do damage to him? To the bloat? Uh, okay. <laughs> Give me some more money. Do we go take Guppy? <sighs> I don't think it does enough for us, because I know we can get other Guppy items. You know what? I'm doing it. I want Guppy. Dead bird. Shh. Okay. That's fine. Guppy will pretty much assure us the win. Which I am down for. Oh, we got Godhead. Okay, we win. We win. I honestly kind of just want to take Book of Revelations just so we can... uh. Was there a key in there? Yes, there was. Just so we can have spirit hearts to just run through this. And we have Guppy. We just got Godhead and Guppy. Okay. It's over. Alright, this, this run's done. Thank you, game, for uh, giving me amazing items on my first greedier mode. So yeah, 100% right choice is going to be take Book of Revelations. I don't think the aura actually gets us these, what's it called? The da, 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 flies. So, hmm. it's not as OP. What am I talking about? It's it's incredibly broken. Um, let me complain about how Godhead doesn't work with Guppy as well as it should, and why my run isn't over already. Let me just complain a lot more. That I'm killing champion versions of monsters under 10 seconds in greedier mode. 
um, excuse me game. But, no. I, I have nothing to complain about. I have no right to complain at this point. This is, this is too good of a run. Now we just have infinite spear arts too. Yeah. Okay. Because uh, Godhead is homing too, I believe. So. We're good. The mark, sure, I'll take more damage. Okay. Not bad at all. Uh, breakfast, sure. The soul, okay. We'll, per we'll take the soul out of all these. Could reroll, but it, it, I don't, I don't care too much about it. Nothing still? What if I just, what, what if I just, What, what if I, what if I just sun card? Can you give me something good, please? Book of Secrets. Bookworm? What? New transformation? I, I wasn't looking. What does it do? But we got a new transformation. I just don't know what it does. Yeah, Book of Revelations gives us charges on this stuff, and so... Mm. There we go. Go ahead fight these guys because we do have the devil already activated. The Book of Belial effect. We're playing we're playing with fire right here. Just walking in front of her the whole time. This is ridiculous damage. I love this. I can't really tell a difference. Probably because I'm just so overpowered already. Uh, normally I'd be all about Cuppy's head, but just give me the soul. Let me just let me just make it easier. Uh, take a key, go check out this curse room just in case. Two spirit hearts, worth it definitely, since we only take half of one. Okay, and we didn't even need the key, we got dead cat. Nine lives, let's go. Alright. Down to Shoal, Curse of the Blind. A little monstro. Oh, look at him. It's a new... Th oh, look at him. He's so cute. Celtic cross. Uh, I always get these cross items confused with each other. Oh, a spirit heart from this stuff? Okay. Thank you. Yeah, this is... Okay. Alright. Alright, game. Thank you. I don't... I'm kind of glad this run happened because I wasn't feeling like an hour-long run because it's been a kind of kind of bad day today. So I'm glad the game kind of, you know, rewarded me for doing absolutely nothing.
besides just deciding to play the game. But yeah, it's, it's been a rough day and I didn't feel like commentating for an hour, even though I would suck at it either way. I feel like it wouldn't be as good though. But that's uh, not really too much of a importance right now. We just go ahead and kill all these guys. Take out all the bosses with extreme ease. Let me go ahead and pop that. Carrion Queens. They attack. Oh, the Charm Tears. Gotcha. Crampo. What you got for me, Crampo? Lump of Coal. Great. I'll take it. And just go down to the next floor. See what fun items we can get down here on the shop. Uh, Satanic Bible. I don't really want any of these. A lot of the martyrs okay at best. But this is like the last floor we have, right? So, out of these, I'll take Blood of the Martyr. And I don't really care that much about Bob's Brain. Uh, check out in here. Nothing really. Bunch of ghosts. Oh, Celtic Cross does. It gives us a chance whenever we're hit, like 20%, I think, for the Polaroid effect. So that's pretty good. Also, I've noticed in this, uh, in Afterbirth Plus so far, whenever enemies spawn on top of you, they die nearly instantly. Big fan of that. Take out these guys, no problem. I've really never got a chance to actually use Godhead before. So, this is, this is pretty fun. I mean, I think I've gotten, like, re-rolls down on the chest or something, but at that point it really doesn't matter what you have anyway. But I do believe that this is going to be the, like, last floor we can shop on. So, if we want to just, uh, take care of all that right now, once we get done with this. Or done with this, I should say. Where, where are the champion versions of these tentacle guys that come out and, and try to smack you? Alright, let's see what we got in our deal with the devil, which is over on this side this time. Alright, a chest that takes us to our deal with the devil and two troll bombs. Wonderful. Uh... Let's take invincibility, temporary invincibility, and blue cap. Why not? I think that's a good choice. So we can just get in there on the uh, ultra greed fight. And go ahead and smack him around a bit with our cube of meat. Yeah, let's go ahead and smack him around a bit with this. If we can get onto him. Alright, he's not really letting us. Okay, maybe that wasn't the best item to take. But I don't think it really matters at this point. Bombs, not a big deal.
More bombs, still, again, not a big deal. Hearts, probably should break some of those. Just, just a regular old heartbreaker over here. Okay, so this... Ah! Is the only thing that's different, like... Maybe there's a better chance for... What is it? Like, champions to spawn? Like, a normal hard mode? More curses? Or maybe it's just the... Just the 10 seconds that you get instead of 30 on the boss fights. Which isn't really a big deal. So, Ultra Greed's going down here pretty quick. Uh, just... Yeah, 24 minute run. 25 minutes, probably. Considering. I'll let, let's, let's use a little Monstro some, too. There you go. Get him, little Monstro. Show him what your tears are made of. Throw up on him some more. For being adorable. Just, just go in there and be adorable. Maybe he'll just kill himself from how adorable it is. Alright. Well, there's Ultra Greed down. On greedier mode. Can I... What do I do? Oh! Okay! This is what I'm talking about. More of a challenge. Okay. It still doesn't seem that bad. You just can't stand at the doors that are opening. Okay. Taking some damage here, though. Damage that I'm not proud of. It is a new boss, though. I'm I I, I starting I'm starting to see the mechanics. For the most part, those explode. Keep forgetting about that. really keep forgetting about that. Oh, okay. Don't stand anywhere near his tears. That's that's the gist of it right now. Uh-oh. Okay. Well, that only did half a heart, and we got our invincibility from Celtic Cross. So. Took a lot more damage on the fight than I thought I would. You know what? Props to you, Ultra Greed. You got some new tricks. You like Crampo, except for the better version. Crampo got a new trick too, but his was just shooting diagonally. Hey, the D1. What? D1? Okay. We'll, we'll see what that is once we come across it. Hopefully soon. Just go ahead, donate what we can here. There might be a new greed thing unlocks. But anyway, uh, 27 minute greedier mode. Uh, we, we got like carried by chaos. But, alright, got greedier done with Isaac now. Uh, so anyway, thank you guys for watching. And if you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. All that stuff really helps me out. And stay tuned for more.